Hi. How are you? Hey. I'm good. You? Doing okay. And hi, everyone. We are back to recording. So, here we are again. So, what have you been working on lately? It's been a little while. Yeah, and that little while got me closer to being motivated to knit more. And I'm actually thinking about making uh, another blanket for our apartment. I think you should go for it. I got a little jealous of your blanket progress, and I think it's something that I need to add. I'm good at mo motivation for blankets and knitting, so I think you should do it. Because I just, as we discussed, finished my second blanket for the year already, so... And it is not a baby blanket. What is it? No, it is my blanket for my cousin's wedding. So it is a full about five to six foot by six foot blanket. So it's a huge blanket. So. Outrageous. I, I think you, your next project should be a blanket. Yeah, I vote for it, because it'll get my knitting mojo going, and it'll use up a huge amount of stash here, and then I have it earmarked for literally nothing. Yeah. Well, if you don't start knitting, then you have to sp uh, spin me some more yarn, because I used it up, and it was great, so. Yeah, my activity today was instead of knitting, uh, meal prep and going magazine shopping and mm. finding. Meal prep's important, so. Hero Nicholas Cage on a cover of a magazine. I think he's everyone's favorite person. So I he's think... the national director, and I paid nine dollars ninety nine cents for this magazine, which is more than I've ever paid a magazine. But I'm very excited, and I think it's worth it. And it, but it's Nicholas Cage, so it's absolutely worth it. So hundred percent. Is he coming out with another movie? Probably eleven. Who knows? Yeah, probably. Like a good actor, he's always working on something, so it's going to be great. Correct. Yes. So. What have you been up to? Show us your actual knitting progress. So, the blanket I just finished. This is what I've just finished. Like I said, it is nice and huge. So, it is lovely. Thank you. I'm excited for it. Um, I actually have to... They're having their wedding party next month, so I have to go down and actually give it to them. But it's going to be interesting because I have to lug... Like, a lot of you know, I'm over in Boston and I have to go down to New York City to give that to them. So it's going to be fun to actually lug that down to New York on an airplane and all that. So that's going to be fun. But... Um, Is there any... So the colors of the blanket like is it their wedding colors or favorite colors it's their favorite colors like that was the nice thing is like i actually got to sit down with them before well not sit down with them like i was t texting them like oh hey what's your favorite color so they know at least uh my cousin knows that it it's coming and they got to decide the colors so it was blue gray and green that they decided on so that's what that's what they get, and um, luckily, I got some good, pretty cheap yarn because um, it is thirty-two hundred yards of yarn that I had to order for it because of just how big it is. So, um, good yarn, cheap yarn is always a plus, just because you know when you're ordering that much, it was fifteen skeins of yarn. So. Uh, I mean, uh, I'm glad you found affordable yarns. So that would be an expensive project otherwise. Yes, yes. So uh, I, I was definitely very happy about that. Um, I mean, as we all know, blankets in general can be pricey quick, quickly. So I was happy to find something good and cheap and easy. Um, but I'm moving on. I, I'm moving on to my next blanket, which I've already started working on. Which is going to be super colorful. Um, I love it so much. Thank you. I, I, I'm really enjoying it a lot too so far. Um, the nice thing is that it's all one strand so I don't have to change color. Which is nice. Yeah, and it's varied enough that you don't have to go crazy about finding like the next colorway start and the next ball of yarn you use. Yeah. You can just join. Yeah. 
Yeah, it makes it very nice and easy. Um, I'm already on my second skein of yarn for that, so which is nice. Two out of ten. So it's probably not going to be as big, but um, it's definitely going to be a nice, sizable blanket, which is going to be nice. Um, but yeah, I'll... a bigger than one person blanket. That's my my life goal. Yes, I believe in you. I want next time. We do... Say again. I think I believe in me. You, th you think you believe in you? You gotta try. You gotta start somewhere. Okay, I guess we will start with that, and it'll be just go up from there. Once I finish my Nicolas Cage magazine, then I can really get into knitting again. Okay, I'm gonna hold you to it. We're we're go all gonna hold you to it, so that way. There might even be an Insta post of what yarn I want to use for the blanket. Who knows? I think you should. I'll be looking for it. I need Good. It. I'm thinking about how I post it. I'm always so jealous of people that post Instagram photos of yarn very beautifully. I'm like, I don't know how to arrange this on my floor so that I have space to put it on. Neither do I. Like, as much as I post Instagram, you would think I would know better, but no. No. I think look them around Nicolas Cage's face and see what happens. I absolutely think Nicholas Cage should be involved in this. Yeah, maybe he may. Oh, if I tag him, I bet he would accept the blanket. He might. I think we're on to something. That would... Plus, it happens. I don't know if he does, uh, you know, Instagram, but maybe he does. His it... publicist like my photo. Yeah. It would be even more motivation to, uh, for you to do the blanket. It's just like, this is for Nicholas Cage. If he can make 39 movies in a year, then I can do something. It has been 39. I think his max is like five, though. Yeah. Yeah, you, uh, see, you always got to keep moving. You always got to go to the next project. Be like Nicolas Cage. Keep going. I'm ready to keep going. I think we found our new mantra and our new way of life. Be like Nicolas Cage. We, too, will one day be national treasures. I'm into it. <laughs> I feel like that's a good stopping point for this week. Until next time, until next week, be like Nicolas Cage. Bye. Bye. <laughs>